know, what was it like working with Falder once once he got to know you? What was he like? I mean, he was really, really a hard man to, to, to carry for. But, I mean, I was so thick-skinned. I just wanted to learn, you know. I mean, some of the stuff that he threw at me, in public now, you know, I mean, it was, it was just made an, an, anyone else just implode, just crumble, you know. Like but what, I, what, you know, what would he say to you? Like, what was his way, you know? Because everybody oh, you know, was a darling of, of a British and world golf. Well, like, you, know? you know, I mean, I was making mistakes. <laughs> and if I made a mistake, you know, he was saying, uh, you know, he was sort of saying, like, me be screaming, right? I mean, saying, you know, we just can't keep on making these mistakes, you know? And everybody's hearing it, you know? So, and I'm going, well, they all know these directing it straight at me. And they're all, the crowd are all going, oh, Caddy's <laughs> made a bit of a faux pas, <laughs> it seems. You know, so, you know, but I mean, anybody else would have been struggling with that. But I just, you know, put the head down and, and carried on. But we became really, really good friends, you know? And I was on a probationary period, you know? But he kind of think he liked he liked once again like my enthusiasm. Is it fair to say that uh, Faldo, because he was harsh with you, he taught you how to be a caddy? Yes, yeah, exactly. That's right. Yeah, he did. You know, so he was very good in that respect. You know, um, and of course I was so like malleable or pliable. I was he could just do whatever he wanted with me. You know, so he just made me into the caddy that he wanted. So and then at the end of the year he won a he won a big tournament at the end of the year and that was my salvation. He says, Right, well we'll go next year and then of course next year he won the European Order of Merit. You know, and then the following year he won in America, which is a big thing for, for mm -hmm. a British player or a European European player at that time, nineteen eighty four. You know, I mean the Americans that was like you know, you can't there's no way you can penetrate that market, you know.